Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new Ninjaga video here on the channel. My name is Tanner Fishies. In today's video, we are going to be discussing something interesting that happened with Ninjaga back during its pilot episodes, and it involves a certain decision made by LEGO and the character of Master Wu. Now, LEGO as a company is just a company, and like a lot of other companies out there, they make mistakes, some of which can be seen as offensive or politically incorrect, whatever you want to phrase it as. Now, usually companies will work hard to correct those offensive mistakes, and LEGO is no exception. In the case of Master Wu, I'm sure you guys know who Master Wu is. If you've seen any little bit of Ninjago, you would recognize Master Wu. He is one of, if not the most iconic character. But for those of you guys that have been watching Ninjago since the beginning, you may remember a certain scene early on in the pilots where his voice sounds a little different than what we're used to. I'm sure a lot of you guys know what I'm talking about, but in case you do not, here is the clip in question. Father would not want you to do this, brother. And here is what Master Wu's voice usually sounds like. Moro may have been my first pupil, but he was also my greatest regret. Now this voice clip is rather iconic throughout the Ninjago community. It's been the subject of many jokes, and I myself use it personally on my streams as my donation sound effect. And I'm sure you guys can recognize the problem with this voice clip, and if not, well for a lot of people, that voice clip of Master Wu saying, Father would not want you to do this, brother. Yeah, that is a little stereotypical, for lack of a better term. And it's very strange because this is the only example of Master Wu sounding like this in the pilot episodes. Throughout the rest of the episodes, he sounds exactly like Master Wu should sound. And yes, Master Wu's real voice is far less offensive than the stereotypical one used in that clip. So what happened with that clip specifically? How exactly did that get in there? Was it a case of different voice actors? Well, no, because Paul Dobson actually recorded both versions of the voice for Master Wu during the pilot episodes. And thankfully, Paul Dobson, again the voice of Master Wu was able to provide us with an answer. During an interview with Brent Miller, who of course is the voice of Zane, Paul Dobson confirmed that the original voice that they had for Wu was, quote, politically incorrect. They recorded the entirety of the pilots with Paul Dobson using that voice, but he had to re-record all of his lines for the final version because, again, that initial voice was a little too stereotypical. And they redid it with the Master Wu voice that we all know and love, the voice that is still being used for Wu to this day. In terms of how that one line slipped through the cracks, well, Paul Dobson confirmed that it was kept in by mistake by the editors, and that's good enough of an explanation for me. It was simply an editing mistake, and an older take was used, instead of one featuring the newer, more politically correct Master Wu voice. Nowhere else in the pilots does Wu use a voice like this, it is just specifically that line, and I can see why people find it offensive. Thankfully, LEGO realized the error of their ways before putting out the episode, but the mistake wasn't corrected entirely, leading to the slip-up that we just mentioned, and I personally don't blame anybody for this, in fact, it's not really my plan to blame anyone for this mistake. Like Paul Dobson confirmed, it was just a simple editing mistake, and they ended up fixing Master Wu's voice before they could even go through with the original voice. LEGO in this case recognized when something was offensive, tried their best to change it before it got out to the public. Unfortunately, one line slipped through the cracks like I said, but still, we know what Master Wu sounds like to this day, and he sounds far more appropriate in my opinion. Master Wu is certainly a character that has had a lot of controversies before, in fact, there was another controversy with Master Wu, with his name being changed from Sensei Wu to Master Wu, but I'll save that discussion for another day, but that is another controversy involving Master Wu. Seems like this character has quite a few controversies under his belt, and for a character as wholesome and kind as Master Wu, you certainly would not expect it. So what do you guys think about this? Leave all your thoughts down below in the comments, hopefully you enjoyed today's video, and like I said, leave all your thoughts down below. What do you think about the older, more offensive voice for Master Wu, and are you happy that they ended up changing it before the pilots even came out? And of course, what do you think about the infamous line that we took a look at quite a bit throughout this video? Leave all your thoughts down below, and I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you guys enjoyed today's video, feel free to like and subscribe to all that fun stuff, and I will talk to you guys again really soon. Peace.